kids. Here's the latest chewing sensation from the USA. A bubble gum that's bursting with flavor. Chew it, munch it, scrunch it, blow it. You'll love it. Have one. Have some. Gator gum. In a variety of great flavors. Grab a box today. Come on, Jake. Yeah, Jake. Jake was just telling me that when he watches Now You See It At Home, he's better at the line game than the main game, but he certainly came through, which shows you how different it is when you actually play in here, isn't it? The main thing is just have a good time. Have you had that? A yes. A good time? Good. Well, I hope you're going to continue to have a good time. Well, these questions look like they might be fairly entertaining for you. No problem. We'll see how you do, mate. I'll take that away. Take up your pen. You have one minute to find the answers to these seven questions. Circle them and tell me what those answers are. Good luck to you. Your time starts from the end of my first question. Here we go. An animal that gives us milk. Pass. Popular for breakfast. Pass. A flower with a yellow centre and white petals. Daisy. Correct. Another word for film. Movie. Correct. Somewhere for you to sit and eat. Table. Correct. If something belongs to you, you are the what? Pass. A machine used to lift and move heavy objects. Crane. Correct. An animal that gives us milk. Pass. Popular for breakfast. Pass. If something belongs to you, you are the what? Pass. An animal that gives us milk. Cow. Correct. Popular for breakfast. Pass. If something belongs to you, you are the what? Pass. Popular for breakfast. Well, he's done very well, but the two he missed are popular for breakfast is the egg. It was hiding at the end of the movie oh, there. The little ones are joke. usually hard to find. No, it wasn't a chicken joke. And if something belongs to you, you are the what? An owner. So that was hiding amongst the cows there. That was probably why it was difficult to find, but you've done very well. I think you'd be a great champ on a day of champions, Jake. And you have a champions t-shirt to wear back on that day, and I'm sure you'll wear it back proudly. We're getting some great champions along for this set. Very good ones indeed, and someone will play for their school and win for their school this major prize. Thanks, Gary. Yes, it's a complete music system, Michael. Semi-automatic belt drive turntable, double cassette deck, 10-band graphic equaliser, three-band AM FM digital tuner, compact display, and two matched three-way speakers. A complete sound system, all you want, presented with the compliments of Sony, and now you see it. So there you go, Jake. So how did you find that solo game? How do you go with them at home? Not very good. Not very good. Well, we'll see. You might be doing better on the day of champions. You might be in that spot, and we'll see how you do. You did well today. Live Thanks, to mate. Fight another we'll day. see you next time we play Now You See It. Bye for now. Bye bye. bye, -bye. There's excitement in the wilds of New Zealand next on 7 in the new adventures of Black Beauty. It's coming up shortly, followed by Sports World. And tomorrow at 7 on Home and Away, Sally regains confidence in Finn when Finn sees the lights and tosses out her pet pills. And Shane's cleaning duties really get out of hand. Visit Summer Bay 7 o'clock tomorrow and hear the latest goss in Home and Away. You See It is produced in association with Mark Goodson by Fremantle International Productions for the Australian Television Network. Gary Clare speaking. You're on Melbourne's Channel 7.